Hi, today I want to give you details about how to become an industrial product designer and what does an industrial product designer do exactly. I hope you have seen my last video about what is industrial product design. If you haven't seen that video, you can visit the link in the description. As an industrial product designer, we have to identify the problem areas and find their solutions to turn them into viable commercial products. Sometimes clients provide us the problem areas and we have to go ahead from that. In few cases, client also provides us a solution as well. In this case, our task is simplified to conceptualize that solution into a product. Now product design starts from defining the physical form of the product or simply shape, considering various factors, defining functions and the concept design may be in the form of 3D model or paper sketches. Once the concept design is ready, we can proceed to DFM. DFM is a term defined as design for manufacturing, means creating a design that is suitable for manufacturing considering various manufacturing processes, materials, etc. So this is the process to convert the problem to a commercial product. Let us see an example. One of my client was from USA and was suffering from finding a uh, suitable matching tie bar for every shoot he wanted to wear daily. He need to match the color or design of the tie bar daily and it was a problem for him every day. A tie bar or a tie pin is a pin to hold the tie. You can see the design of the tie bar uh, which is composed of mainly two components. One is uh, the clasp which is used to hold the tie and second is the uh, cover. We call it a cover that is uh, to display mainly uh, the design part of that. After brainstorming, he came to know that he can separate the clasp from the cover and also try to find a solution to attach that cover so that it can be removed and replaced easily. So he got an idea of magnets and that bucket. He got samples made and rest is the history. The project was also crowdfunded. Now you can purchase the tie bar from his company, One Barco. I have designed that tie bar for him. So this was an example of product design process. There are mainly two types of projects while uh, working as an industrial product designer. First is customizing existing products to enhance the design, functioning or combining multiple products into a single product. But the fact is that we are having a starting point for that. Like we saw in the one barco tie bar that we are having an existing design which we are customizing to solve the existing problem. Second is a radical product design or we can say a completely new product design that was never ever seen and does not exist in the market. Such a design that cannot be replaced till decades like a ceiling fan or an electric motor. Now, there can be various designs of the ceiling fan right now in the market but the basic design is still driven from the original invented design that was uh, invented in 1889. Such a design that cannot be replaced easily. Similar way an induction motor was invented and since then the design is basic design is same since the uses and uh, purpose may be different. So that type of design are called radical product design. The job of an industrial product designer involves following tasks. Identification of problem areas in the human life, search for their solutions, concept design or ideations to convert that solution into a product. It involves hand sketching or 3D modeling using computer. After the concept design or the idea is finalized, we need to create a design ready for mass production or a prototype is made to validate the design idea. It involves working on 3D CAD softwares and making manufacturing drawings and creating graphics images for marketing or visualizations. This is all about the work areas of an industrial product designers who create wonderful products to easy our life. Now the question is how to become an industrial product designer. Since this is a core technical aspect to design products for manufacturing, engineering subjects knowledge plays a crucial role in that. If you are an engineer or studying engineering, then surely this can be a great career option for you. 
obviously this is not an easy task to conceptualize the ideas for new products but with subject knowledge proper guidance and some experience you can design stunning products we at neox tech have launched a training program on industrial product design that is basically designed for engineering professionals to become industrial product designers and work in the field of r&d product design machine design etc this is a training program designed to cover every aspect of industrial product design with exposure on live projects including consumer products automotive components sheet metal products machine design furniture items kitchen accessories door and window profiles etc etc there is also placement and interview assistance along with the support to design new products for aspiring entrepreneurs after becoming good at industrial product design you can also provide services to the companies to create new products for them so this is a wide field with unlimited potential for more details about the training program you can find the details in the description or you can contact us to know your suitability for the program